what is good what is popping welcome back to another video in today's video we are going to be talking about the two rescue ships that the interior minister of italy has allowed them to disembark migrants in italy after malta denying them a safety port to disembark these migrants in malta and this time around the interior minister has done an amazing job because the ngos they were saying that the weather is not good and a lot of people has passed through i mean problems so finally they cried out and italy has allowed them to drop these migrants they were over 500 migrants you understand because this italian interior minister is saying they will not receive migrants but day in day out there is a situation that come one way or the other so that they will allow them to drop these migrants here they said italy took in more than 500 migrants on sunday december 11th as two private rescue ships were allowed to dock at ports in the south of the country after several days at sea in bad weather the geo balance ship operated by the doctors without borders borders charity and which had 248 migrants on board disembarked in Salerno in the southwestern region of Campania. Uh, the second ship, the Humanity One, ran by the charity source who, uh, Humanity, docked in the port of Bari after Italian authorities agreed to grant it permission. The ship had 261 migrants uh, on board and reportedly had faced three three meter high waves and strong winds throughout the journey source humanity said in a tweet uh, italy has vowed at a tough line on migration interior ministry sources said the decision to allow the two sea ships to dock was based on the poor weather condition and the risks faced by those on board rather than representing a change of policy writers report the ministry was working uh, was working on a new regulations to protect Italy borders and and halt the people smugglers the sources said according to real in the picture since from the disembarkation of geo barant and humanity one on december 11 2022 so as i said before two ngos the humanity one and the geo barant so the geo barant disembarked migrants in salerno and then the humanity one also dog or allowed to disembark migrants in Bari. So the interior minister once again has done an amazing job because I was not expecting that he would even allow any NGO to disembark migrants in Italy again after what happens between them, between Italy and France about this migration issue. And I have the video too. Let's go and watch the video when we are back we will give you the rest of the update. So stay. Finalmente ritrovano la terraferma dopo giorni di mare e incertezza e mesi di tormenti. Tra i 248 migranti della Joe Barents sbarcati a Salerno c'è lei, una donna di 32 anni scappata dal Camerun, dal marito violento che le ha provocato due aborti, che ha attraversato il deserto e lì ha perso la sua unica bambina per malattia. Ad accogliere i migranti al porto questo striscione di benvenuto. Poche immagini, perché il prefetto ha vietato le riprese dello sbarco, un divieto pretestuoso, un attacco alla libertà di informazione per Lucy Gray. Le migrazioni e l'accoglienza non sono un fatto di emergenza, ma sono strutturale della nostra società. Nel mondo abbiamo 100 milioni di migranti che vagano, per cui c'è bisogno di conoscenza politica, cultura, interesse e competenze. Il via libera allo sbarco dell'ONG non solo a Salerno, ma anche qui a Bari, dove è attraccata la Humanity One con oltre 260 migranti, tra loro diversi, con segni di tortura e due arrivi che suonano come una breccia nella politica degli sbarchi selettivi, anche se fonti del Viminale chiariscono che non si tratta di una retromarcia, ma una scelta dettata dall'approssimarsi del maltempo, che avrebbe esposto le persone a bordo a dei rischi. Mare che però non impedisce nuovi sbarchi anche sulle coste calabresi, un moto peschereccio con quattro 400 persone a bordo è stato scortato dalla Guardia di Finanza e dalla Guardia Costiera verso il porto di Reggio Calabria. Qui metà dei migranti ha iniziato le procedure sanitarie e amministrative, mentre gli altri andranno a Messina. As I hope you have seen the video, so that is how this migrants landed in Italy. And if there is any update, we will still let you know. And if you have not followed me yet on Instagram, please go and do so. On TikTok, go and do so. On Facebook, 
go and follow me on the all the social media platform because sometimes there are some videos you have to put it on instagram there are some videos you have to put it on tiktok there are some videos you have to put it on facebook so if you follow all the platform that is where it is going to do what it is going to help you and you have, if you're watching me please try to give me a thumbs up for the video and share to a brother until we meet again in the next video please stay safe and stay blessed peace